Hi, this is Amy, and today I want to show you this amazing new tool that's now integrated into Google Docs, and it's called Voice Typing. So I want you to know that this is available, but I also want to show you how you could use this for students who are learning a foreign language or students who are learning English, period. And you can see it typed a period. Um, which is quite handy. But I also want you to know that if a student is trying to learn how to speak English, that this tool will give them a totally non-judgmental way to practice. Uh, and the same goes for any foreign language. So let me show you how to enable it and then how to change the language of your document should you need to do that. So in order to enable it, we're going to go into Tools in our Google Doc and go to Voice Typing. So it's going to open up and allow you to speak in the language that Google Docs is set to. So you just saw me do it in English. All I did to start it was just click on the microphone and as soon as the microphone activates, it's just going to start typing. Of course, you do have to have a microphone. It also helps to be in a quiet environment. And as you can see, I'm wearing this headset, which also makes it easier for the tool to understand you. So let's change our document now to a foreign language and we'll see how that works. So to change our document to a new language, we're going to go into File, and then we're going to go into Language, and we're going to change the language of this document. So the only foreign language that I know anything about at all, and it's very minimal, so don't try to speak to me in French, but I have a little tiny bit of French from college. So I'm going to change my document into French, and now when I activate my voice typing, it's going to be listening for French. You can see that now all of my words are misspelled because this document should be in French. Now I didn't change my whole Google to French, which is also possible, just this document. So <clears throat> let me try it in my very rusty French. Bonjour, je m'appelle Amy. C'est un plaisir de faire votre connaissance. So you can see it, it did not do this completely correct because it doesn't know the name Amy, so it said no Amy, but it's still pretty good and I'm sort of proud that Google understands me speaking French. So to all the French people out there, stop laughing. I did the best I could and I needed to show you this tool so you could use it. So I hope you enjoy it. Uh, thanks for listening and for watching. And uh, if you end up using this, let me know in the comments or send me an email and have a great day. Bye-bye.